What is good, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Al Kicks, a.k.a. the UI General, and we're back with another sneaker review. And today, we got those New York Nick Dunks, orange, blue, and a little bit of white. Let's go ahead and check them out right here. And the label says Nike Dunk High Retro. The color code is orange, orange, deep royal, and my size is size 10. And these did retail for $125, nothing crazy on the box, just that reproduction orange box we've been getting for the past few years. And let's go ahead and look at these bad boys right here. Starting off first, you have, it's just thin leather going around the whole shoe, real cheap. Feels real thin and boxy like, but the colorway to me is spice. You know, I got my orange and blue on, so you know this is popping. It is Mets, Knicks, Islanders, however you want to dig it. So you got the orange layers and overlays. You have the blue thin leather as an underlay on the toe box, as well as on the heel, medial panels and side panels. Perforation on the toes for breathability. White midsole. Orange outsole, same outsole as the Jordan one, of course. Very iconic. Only difference between those shoes is on the dunk, there's no air. On the laces, you have these cheap, silky looking laces that look like they're premium, but they're really not premium. I kind of wish they'll just go back to the old laces. On the dunks, now on the tongue, it's a nylon tongue under here. And at the top, it's a blue nylon tag with the orange nike i thought it was a nice touch as well as an orange underline going well not an underline but an overlay going around the tongue i think that's what makes this sneaker stand out and look good orange swoosh on the medial as well as lateral sides on the interior orange with an orange floorboard with a blue nike on it nothing too crazy nothing too shabby as far as the fit, I definitely suggest going true to size. If you have a wide foot, you can always go a half size up on these kicks because the quality is not the best. If you are a wide footer, this shoe may hurt your foot, being that it is narrow at the toe. And that's pretty much it about these sneakers. You can find them. You can find these everywhere. They're very readily available. They're not as cool as the Pandas or whatever they keep selling out and keep restocking and then the resale is so high. I guess it's a very common shoe. People are calling this shoe the Air Force One of today, which I think is total bullshit, but tomato, tomato. Guys, tell me what do you think in the comments below is this or the Lakers pair of pairs that you're checking for. You know what I'm saying? As for me, I know I don't have many of these newer dunks, but you know, being I'm a Mets fan and I like the orange and blue color scheme, these were a must cop for me and I'm glad that they were already available. I will drop some links in the description so anybody else want to cop these or get their cop on, go ahead and cop these, flavor them up with your outfits <laughs> and do your thing. Now, before we go, I picked up the five red threes. I will be showing those. So look forward to that video coming next. And I enjoyed this. I enjoyed you guys. Again, let me know how you feel about these in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And that is right, ladies and gentlemen. Bang that notification bell. Turn those post notifications on so you don't miss a beat. You know the model by now. I'm wild. You wild. We all wild, baby. Stay fly. Stay fresh. But most importantly, stay safe. It's your boy, Big Al Kicks, signing on out of here. Peace.